Here is how you can fill in an assignment in your worksheet in Google Classroom using your mobile device. First, open the Classroom app. Check that you are signed into your student account and enter your classroom. Now, in the stream will appear all the announcements and posts by your teachers and classmates. Under classwork, the assignments are set as per subject. For instance, you can see English literature, chemistry, mathematics. If you wish to see all the assignments that are due, tap on the icon on the top right of your screen which looks like a clipboard and a person. Tap on that and it now gives you a list of all assignments with the due date listed under it. For instance, we can see cyber safety PowerPoint has no due date. However, you do have worksheet due today. On the right, I will see work which has been assigned and work which is missing. So let's tap on the worksheet. This opens up the assignment and I can read what the teacher has posted and follow those instructions. At the bottom, I see your work. So if I swipe up on that, I can see an English language worksheet is attached here with my name. Tap on it to open it and this now opens as a PDF. A PDF means that you can't really enter any information into it, but you can add information on the top of it. To add information on top of a PDF, tap on the pencil icon on the top right and now you come into a kind of an edit mode where you have options. If you look at the bottom, there's a blue pen which is marked. If I use that, I can draw on this. I also see on the right, there's an A icon which means a text icon. Now. I can insert a text box and type in anything I wish. But the teacher has not asked me for this really. The teacher wants me to enter text where it says click here. So this will not really do. I tap on the back arrow and it says discard changes. I say discard since I don't want to save this. Now to enter the edit mode where I can actually enter text into this slideshow, I tap on the box which has an arrow sticking out of it. That's on the top right of my screen. Tap it and now it is opening the same document in Google Drive. There we see English language abstract nouns worksheet. So I can go to the slide where I need to enter my work and where you can see click here, just tap on that, highlight click here so that you can remove it or just delete the click here text and now you can type in your answer. And that's it. Once you've completed everything, then just tap on the tick mark at the top left and that's it. Press the X. Press the back arrow on the top left and now since you finished your work, you can just select turn in to submit this assignment. So that's how we have submitted our work to the teacher. But what if after submitting you realize that there's something more that you could have added or something that you've forgotten. So you can then in that case click unsubmit and you can see at the bottom it says work unsubmitted and my worksheet has appeared over there. So I would again open it, tap on the little box with an arrow on the top right. It's opening in Google Drive. Go back to my assignment and enter what I need to enter. And when I've completed that, tap the blue tick mark on the top left. Close it, go back and then once again, turn in. Here you can see it says it's going to resubmit this document. So that's how you can fill in a worksheet in Google Classroom using your mobile device.